how to install Android 12 Beta 3.1 on the Poco F3, the Mi 11X or the Redmi K40. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Android 12 Beta 3.1 from the Google Pixel 5 on the Xiaomi Mi 11X or the Poco F3 or the Redmi K40. Do note these are exactly the same devices with minor hardware differences sold as different names in different regions. Now what are the prerequisites for this video? Well for starters you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and then the next thing you need to have is access to a computer and no you cannot do this without access to a computer. Another thing you need to note is that you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. So make sure you do have a backup of all those things. Also the developer does recommend that you come from Xiaomi EU ROM and me personally I am not going to show you how to install the EU ROM in this video but the video on how to install Xiaomi EU ROM on your POCO F3, Mi 11X or the Redmi K40 can be found in the description of this video. Another thing I would like to mention is that make sure that your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent. Again do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent. So here it is I do have the POCO F3 which right now is running MIUI 12.5.4 but this is Xiaomi EU. So Installing Xiaomi EU is a prerequisite for this specific build of Android 12 beta for the POCO F3, the Redmi K40 or the Xiaomi Mi 11X, whatever you want to call it. Next up, we will go into settings and then you can go into password and security, remove your screen lock, fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done, go back, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done, go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your Google account. Once you have removed all the accounts and security measures, make sure you reboot your device once. Why are we removing all the accounts and security measures? We're doing this because we are going from one ROM to another and I don't want you to be locked out of your own device. Next thing we need to do is we need to boot into fast boot mode. So first of all, turn off your device and once the device has turned off, we need to press and hold power and volume down press and hold power and volume down till you see this logo so this is the fast boot logo for xiaomi or redmi or poco and at this point we need to connect the usb cable so that we can connect our phone to the computer so here we are on the computer and of course the phone is connected to the computer and the phone is in fast boot mode now i have placed this android 12 beta 3.1 for the mi 11x k40 or the poco f3 inside a folder and this is an archive file which does need to be un archived or unzipped i am using winrar you can use any software which you want to all you have to do is right click and say extract to the file name and then you will have a new folder just to make it faster i have extracted it already and if i go inside this folder here are the contents first of all let us check whether our device is being detected in fast boot mode or not so go inside this win tools folder because we are using windows tap on the address bar everything will be highlighted type in cmd press the enter key this is going to open a command prompt window over here here and we need to type in fast boot space devices and then we are going to press the enter key there it is you can see the device is being detected in fast boot mode if your device is not detected that means you do not have the drivers installed how do you do that we have a video for that which can be found in the description of this video next thing we need to do is we need to go back to the main folder where we have all the files and all the folders like linux tools mac tools win tools and to install android 12 beta 3.1 on windows we need to use this file which says over here windows batch file installation as easy as double clicking the file that will open a command prompt and the flashing process will start do note you have to be patient the phone might reboot or it might seem that nothing is happening but again be patient so let us go ahead and double click on this so as you can see once we double clicked on 
the file it sent a few files the device rebooted a few times and we did get the message of invalid sparse file format at header magic but you need not worry about it you can ignore it and pretty soon you should have super partition flashing and the failed to write device failed these two errors can be ignored do note that flashing the super partition will take some time so you have to be patient so as you can see we have now reached the super partition 9 of 9 which means our device should you know after this reboot perform and arrays of user data factory reset all those things there it is finished user data was erased which is your factory reset and now as you can see it is telling us we can press any key to exit now at this point if you're still stuck in fast boot mode what do you do you press and hold power and volume up together press and hold power and volume up together once you see the Poco logo or feel the vibration you can let go of the power button at this point you are going to boot into twrp recovery again please note that keep volume up pressed once you are in twrp you will go into wipe format data type in yes do note that format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device and then press the enter key of course you can disconnect your phone from the computer we do not need the computer anymore now format data was performed without any issues and the errors of failing to mount the partitions can be ignored tap on the home button go into reboot and here and all you need to do is select system and there it is as you can see we now have the google boot animation on our poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 which means we are booting into android 12 beta 3.1 on our device now do note the first boot up might take some time so you have to be patient and we are on the setup screen you will get this message every time that there is an internal problem just select ok google speech might crash close the application android beta program might get this also every time just select ok and now let me skip the initial setup real quick and there it is we are now on the home screen let us go into settings about phone will of course show it as the pixel 5 and now if i tap on the android version here it is android version is 12 security patches from august build number is spb 3.2 which means this is android 12 beta 3.1 installed successfully on the poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you